Hi, everybody. Welcome back. This is Todd Gotches from Colorado Local, and I'm here with Deanna Woodruff from Vibrant Health of Colorado down in Lone Tree. Uh, she's got a medical practice down there we're going to talk a little bit about. So, Deanna, if you could uh, tell us a little bit about your business, what you do, where you're located, uh, just take it away. Sure. Thank you. Um, we are located in Lone Tree um, at the Sky Ridge Medical Center. Um, we are a practice that focuses primarily on what I would call functional medicine. Um, we certainly use traditional medicine. We use prescriptions when we need to, but our goal is really to help people either um, return to or maintain vibrant health. Um, we look at hormone balance. We do a lot of hormone therapy. We do um, primary care. We look at gut health, um, autoimmune disease, um, we really just try to return the body to balance using nutrition and hormones, thyroid, um, stress reduction. Uh, we have a lot of things that we look at. Um, we treat a lot of patients that have what I would consider to be difficult to treat things like um, some chronic conditions like chronic fatigue syndrome, irritable bowel syndrome, um, fibromyalgia. Um, Deanna, people, do you use a lot of homeopathic type of treatments or is it um, more uh, something a little bit different? So we don't do homeopathy. Um, you know, sometimes I refer out, you know, to things that are kind of outside the scope of, of medicine. Um, we do use some supplements, um, but I would say that the main things that we focus on are nutrition, um, hormones, thyroid, that kind of stuff. So more of a balanced lifestyle, more than a... a like a, you said, no prescriptions, things like that, just more of a, a healthy lifestyle. So we do, I mean, we do practice traditional Western medicine as well. And when we need prescriptions, we write them. Um, it's just more of a, a focus. Western medicine tends to focus on um, treating symptoms with medication. So we do that when necessary, but we really try to find the root cause um, and kind of return the body to health and not have to use as many prescriptions. Oh, that's great. I think that's a, that's a really good approach to it. Now, how long have you been in business down there and uh, what kind of uh, a demographic do you serve? What, what? Sure. So um, in this practice, this practice is fairly new. We started in September. Um, I have been in practice doing what I do for about 16 years. Um, here in the office, we um, specialize in both men and women, um, you know, depending on the provider that you see. Um, so you know, do, you, do you take insurance or do, I know you're taking new clients? How is that working for that? Yeah, we do take insurance. We are um, taking new patients. Um, yeah, definitely. Okay. And so um, do you have uh, like specific um, type of clientele you're looking for? Is there a specific, uh, like you said you treat like uh, some, some difficult to treat syndromes like um, irritable, irritable bowel and chronic fatigue and things like that. Is there something that you more focus on or is it just kind of the overall health thing? I would say, you know, most of our most successful patients are people that have seen, you know, specialists, they've seen a lot of doctors, they aren't feeling good. That can be a lot of things, GI symptoms or fatigue or body pain. Um, menopausal symptoms or symptoms of andropause. Um, they've kind of been told their labs are normal and there's not anything that they can do. I would say that's where our biggest focus is. We find that that's often not the case. We can dig a little bit deeper and, and usually figure out what's going on or at least, um, you know, make some progress. So if, if someone has gone to their doctor and they say, yeah, you're, all your tests look good and everything seems fine, but, you know, you're still not getting any results, how would they know to look for a, a, a service, a, a healthcare provider like yourself, as opposed to like a regular Western medicine kind of deal? Sure, so I think it's become more, much more common, honestly. Um, I think a lot of people are, are looking for doctors and nurse practitioners and PAs that do this um, because they're frustrated with being told that they're fine or that um, they're making their symptoms up or that, you know, there's just nothing wrong. It's frustrating to know that you feel bad, um, but not be able to find any answers. So, um, it's definitely gotten more common over the years that I've done it. Um, sometimes it's a little harder to find someone that takes some medical insurance. So, um, and we, you know, we like that being able to work through medical insurance. So that's a big deal for us. Awesome. And then is this your only location, Lone Tree, or do you have another office somewhere? You said you're fairly new down there. 
So this is our only um, location for Vibrant Health. We are um, an affiliate of um, OBGYN, OBGA or OBGYN affiliates. So um, there are other offices within that larger group, but Vibrant Health, this is our only location. Okay, and you said uh, earlier when we were chatting that it's you and a partner. And so if it's just the two of you, is there a waiting period to be able to get in to visit you? So I have a partner. Um, she is a medical doctor. Um, but I also have another nurse practitioner and I have a physician assistant as well. So um, right now, depending on what someone needs, um, I wouldn't say that we have a wait. We're doing a lot of telehealth right now. So that's also an option. Okay. So um, you're doing uh, so um, like video conferencing and things like this, mm -hmm. but your office is still open if you need to come down and, and see you. Yep, exactly. If someone needs to get in or they need an exam or um, it's more acute, we can definitely see them in the office. We're here every day. Um, and if it's something that can be done via telehealth, then we do that. Excellent. And then as far as treatment, um, do you have, I know every case is a little bit different, but um, typically, do you, do you, how long does it take to start seeing results? Just kind of on average, I know it's, you know, it's different on, on every case, but Sure. Um, you know, it's a little bit different than traditional medicine, so I'm just curious uh, how that is, is different. Yeah, it definitely it definitely depends. Um, I would say specifically when you're talking about hormones, usually you see results pretty quickly. People start feeling better, sleeping better. Um, it depends on the person too. The more they're willing to do with lifestyle, with nutrition changes, um, with stress reduction, that makes a big difference. Um, but again, when you're working with thyroid and you're working with hormones um, and really focusing on, on overall health, people start to get better really quickly. That's awesome. It sounds like you're really uh, making a difference in helping people um, to live not only healthier, but to kind of get away from the, the, the chemicals and, the, and the, you know, a lot of the, the big pharma kind of, like you say, they, they want to treat the symptom and not necessarily the cause. So I think that's, yeah. that's refreshing. Thank you. We try. Well, let me ask you this, Deanna. Um, if someone wanted to schedule an appointment with you, do you have a web page? How would they go about doing that? Yeah, so we do have a web page. It's just um, vibranthealthofcolorado.com. Um, and then our office number as well is 303-730-2229. Um, so they could always call the front desk and get more information. We also do, um, we do offer um, free consults, usually telehealth right now just to kind of have a discussion and see if we're a good fit. Excellent. No, it sounds like it's a great, uh, it's a great practice you have going there. And I feel like you're going to help a lot of people. So what we're going to do is we're going to put your contact information below this video. Uh, okay. We'll put your website, your phone number, and uh, get a way for people to get in touch with you. Um, in the meantime, is there anything you'd like to add uh, at the end of this interview? Um, no, I think that's it. Thank you so much for doing this. I've appreciated the other videos I've seen and it's, it's just nice nice thing to do right now. Well, I really appreciate you taking the time out to, to spend with us and also being a member of the Colorado Local Group uh, to build our local business community because I think that it's important um, to focus on some local businesses rather than a lot of the big box things that, that you know everyone's familiar with. So I appreciate you taking the time and being a member of our group. Thank you. Well, Deanna, I appreciate it. You have a wonderful day. And I'll, again, I say we'll leave your information on the bottom of the screen. And, uh, and uh, thank you so much. And we'll talk again. All right. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.